Hello everyone, Miss Baker here to show you some different ways that you can make art. Today we're going to be talking about the Lynchburg burning method, which is a wood burning technique. I'm here with my good friend Jeff Sweet. Oh yeah. And we're going to show you some good stuff. So this is basically, guys, where art can meet science, okay? You have a piece of wood, okay, and you have a mixture. Your mixture is going to be one cup of warm water with one tablespoon of baking soda. Now, you're using electricity to burn wood. Don't try this at home unless your dad's an electrician, then maybe you can do it with him, but don't try it at home. For now, you can watch and learn. So you want to wet your board down with the mixture that you mixed up. Get yourself a spoon or a fork or maybe a little whisk if you have it. Get yourself a little brush and paint it across your wood. You're going to want to let that set for five minutes. I'm ready. So here we have these nails on either side of the board of wood. Again, do not try this at your own home, please. <laughs> But this is a good way to see how art doesn't always just have to be art. Art can be combined with science, in this case, electricity. And it's burning into the wood, and it almost looks like aerial views of a river or maybe something like the Lake of the Ozarks. Now, once it starts to connect like it is there, that's when you know you're going to be close to finishing. Right, Jeff? Yep. Now this guy's a pro. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Then you're going to want to take a little, what, is, what do you, what do you call that, like a little wire brush. wire brush. And you get into all the little crevices. and you start just brushing away. get a finished one to show you guys what it ends up looking like when you're completely finished. Oh my gosh, it almost looks like a skull here. Like, see, like there's the eye and the nose. Almost looks like a skull. Sick. Right back here. Okay. I was originally wanting to do this with eighth grade and surprise them this year, um, unfortunately. Well, there's one that was done in cedar. So this is a finished one. It's absolutely beautiful. Almost looks like maybe roots of a tree or something. Now if you want, we can go mix the color and pour it in it. Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay. 
we're gonna mix some color and pour some epoxy in there. And then this is what it looks like when you pour the epoxy in there. Ooh, gorgeous. So we have, is it like, what kind of powder is it that you mix in with the epoxy, LaDonna? It's a mica powder powder. Beautiful. So pretty. Yeah. So yeah, you can hit pause and we go set this up 